India is on the bucket list for many travelers, and it's no mystery why. The diverse landscape, colorful festivals, and spicy hot cuisine are already reasons enough to pack your bags to visit Mumbai or Varanasi. Whether you've been to India before or are just fascinated with this country, here are some interesting facts about India that might surprise you. There's a floating post office in India. Not only does India have the largest network of postal services in the world, but it also has some very unique post offices, including one that floats on the water. Located in Dal Lake, Srinagar, the post office has begun to serve as a tourist destination for curious visitors who hope to photograph the unique site. Trust me, Srinagar is one of the most beautiful places in India. The Amritsar Golden Temple serves free meals, dot for thousands. The Amritsar Golden Temple is one of the most dazzling architectural monuments in India, but it is also a site of generosity and compassion. This Sikh temple is open to people of all religions. Every day, it serves a simple vegetarian meal, often to over 50,000 people. What's even more impressive is that almost all the ingredients are donated. Cows are considered sacred. If hamburgers are a regular part of your diet, you'll need to make some adjustments before visiting India. Cows are protected by their own set of rules in the constitution, making killing a cow a crime. Even on crowded city streets, cows have the liberty to roam where they please without fear of being harassed by humans. India has over 300,000 mosques and over 2 million Hindu temples. Get ready to be awed and amazed by all the stunning architecture India has to offer. About 15% of India's population is Muslim. The mosques across the country range from small village buildings to immense famous ones, like the Mecca Masjid in Hyderabad or the Jama Masjid in New Delhi. The same can be said about India's Hindu temples, which surpass 2 million to serve the 79.8% of India's Hindu population. Just the holy city of Varanasi has over 23,000 temples. It is safe to say India is the land of temples. Rajasthan has a temple of rats. The animal wonders of India continue. Although rats might not be the first species you think of to worship, there is a temple in Rajasthan dedicated to rats. Thousands of rats call the temple home, making it one of the country's most unique attractions. Many pilgrims visit the temple every year on their own religious journeys, so make sure to be respectful of local customs when visiting. Home of a mysterious skeleton lake. Located in the Himalayas at about 16,470 feet, the glacial lake Rupkind has become famous for the human skeletons found in the lake and surrounding areas. It is thought that the skeletons are the remains of people from the 9th century who perished during a severe hailstorm. India was the first country to mine diamonds. From the 4th century BC for around 1000 years, India was the only source of diamonds in the world. The original diamonds were found in the Krishna River Delta. In the 18th century, more diamond deposits were discovered in Brazil, and soon after, in South Africa, adding to the market of diamonds. India has 22 recognized languages. The numerous languages spoken across India include Santali, Kashmiri, Bengali, Tamil, and Urdu. However, the official languages are English and Hindi. India also has the world's second largest population of English speakers, first as the United States, since most Indians speak their own regional language as well as English for easier communication. Sanskrit is considered the oldest language in the world, the mother of all languages. Every Hindu book is written in Sanskrit, and it is said that Sanskrit is the language of the demigods. Most Indians eat with only their fingers. It's customary in India to eat food with your fingers, including rice, sauces, meats, and vegetables. Some people argue that to truly enjoy an authentic Indian curry, it's a requirement to eat the dish with your hands. Don't be afraid to forego the use of a fork, knife, and spoon while you're in India, just watch how the locals do it and try finger food out for yourself. A village with no locks and doors may be the safest on earth. The village of Shani Shingnipur is famous for not having a door or lock on a single house. Beyond that, there has not been a recording of a criminal act for almost 400 years. Many people think that the shared vulnerability has created a neighborly trust between the residents, which has formed a protection stronger than a deadbolt or heavy gate. Holi is much more than a colorful powder festival. Holi, also known as the Festival of Colors, is the popular Hindu spring festival celebrated across India and Nepal. 
Holi's name comes from, Holika, the sister of demon king, Hiranyakashyap, and it signifies the victory of good over evil. It also marks the end of the winter season, welcoming the spring. While the festival is well known for its colorful powders, water also is a big part of the event as many people use water balloons to engage in water fights with family and friends. Beyond being a national festival in India, these days, Holi is celebrated by Hindus all over the world. In some places in India, Coke and Pepsi are used as pesticides. In the Chhattisgarh state of India, which is one of the world's largest rice-producing areas, farmers began to spray their fields with Coke and Pepsi products, since it was cheaper than traditional pesticides and seemed to work just as well. On looking more closely at this method, it's thought that the sweet syrups attract ants to the field, which eat the eggs and larvae of insects that commonly destroy crops. India has one of the lowest divorce rates in the world. According to statistics, the divorce rate in India is about one out of every 100 marriages, making it much lower than most countries. This may be partly due to cultural customs and the fact that arranged marriages still occur in India. India has the current tallest statue in the world. Measuring 600 feet 182 meters in height, the Statue of Unity is currently the tallest statue in the world. The statue, which is a tribute to the independence leader Sardar Vallabhai Patel, is located in the western state of Gujarat, where Patel was born. For comparison, this statue is almost twice as tall as the Statue of Liberty, 305 feet or 93 meters. It is made with more than 12,000 bronze panels and weighs about 67,000 tons. India was the first country to refine and consume sugar. If you have a sweet tooth, you have India to thank for it. India was the first place where sugar was extracted, refined, and used in cooking, although once people got a taste of the delicious stuff, sugar production quickly spread around the world. Shampoo originated in India. The word, shampoo, comes from the Sanskrit word, shampoo, which means, to massage. Ground herbs mixed with water were the very first forms of shampoo. Not until later, when the idea caught on were commercial bottles produced, Gandhi is one of India's most famous icons. Revered the world over for his nonviolent philosophy of passive resistance, Mohandas Karamchand Gandhi was known to his many followers as Mahatma, or, the Great Souled One. He was also commonly referred to a Bapu, which means father. In the years following World War I, he became the leading figure in India's struggle to gain independence from Great Britain. After partition in 1947, he continued to work toward peace between Hindus and Muslims until his death, when he was fatally shot in Delhi in January 1948 by a Hindu fundamentalist. Gandhi's face has appeared on all denominations of Indian rupees printed since 1996. These amazing facts about India are just the tip of the iceberg. This country has so many surprises in store for travelers. There's nothing quite like real-life experience, so if these fun facts about India have piqued your curiosity, get ready to have your mind blown when you travel there in person.